Hello everyone, this is Joe W. I'm going to review now That's What I Call Music 39 today. It came out early 1998. Mm, not much to say about the front cover. It's kind of all locked in. I mean, the face got colours, but uh, mm, not the, it's too much of a close-up for me. So, anyways, let's get into it. 41 chart hits. Starting with this one, of course. First one is All Saints Never Ever. Um, Lighthouse Memory High, which is a decent feel good tune. Um, Janet Jackson Together Again, I quite like that tune, yeah. Um, especially the music. Um, Spice Girls Stop, which is pretty much fun, yeah. Um, Natalie and Brugria Torn, my favourite whole disc, yeah. Um, very nice feel good tune. Um, Billy Myers, Kiss the Rain, Robbie Williams, Angels, another favourite of the disc for me, yeah. Yeah, one of the best Robbie Williams songs, I think. Um, various Artists, Perfect Day, um, 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 I found it a little boring, to be honest. Um, Boy Zone, Baby Can I Hold You, Tintin Out, Feet, Sherry Nelson, Here's Where the Story Ends, Space with Keris of Catatonia, which is basically Keris Matthews, um, The Ballad of Tom Jones. It's a pretty good tune, in my opinion. Um, Texas Insane. Hanson, Weird. Hmm. It's a very weak song for me, uh, to be honest. Um, Rianne Rhymes, How Do I Live? Shania Twain, You're Still the One. Shell Crow, Tomorrow Never Dies. Hmm. I found it, um, a, 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 um, awful to be honest. Um, I mean, like a um, bomb themes and um, yeah, a bit dramatic. Okay, um, Radio Heads, no surprises. The Verve, Lucky Man, and um, Pulp. This is hardcore. I quite like the last three tunes. So, um, this is maybe like pop, feel good. Um, yeah, a little rock in the end, and um, some ballads. Well, this too. Starting with Robbie Williams, Let Me Entertain You, yeah, uh, another favourite, um, yeah, um, I think it's better than Angels, to be honest, um, I mean, it's my opinion anyway, um, Catatonia, Maldon Scully, Corner Shop, Brain for of Asher, Norman Cook Remix, my favourite of a whole CD, yeah, it's a brilliant, um, um, dance pop tune, um, Run DMC versus Jason Nevins, it's like that, yeah, very classic old school tune, one of my favourites, along with Wild Child, Renegade Master 98. Yeah, um, yeah, those two are really um, brilliant old school tunes for me. Um, Bamboo, Bamboogie, which features a sample of a uh, case in the Sunshine Band's uh, Get Down Tonight. Um, it's a great remix for me. Um, Ultranate, Found a Cure, um, it's very decent. Sash, La Prima Vera, Aqua Barbie Girl, I think we all know that one, and I'm not a fan of it to be honest. Steps 5, 6, 7, 8, yeah, yeah, really fun, a catchy tune, yeah, I know you guys might find it weird that I don't like Barbie Girl, but I do like the 5, 6, 7, 8, but we all have an opinion. Um, Louise, let's go around again, yeah, yeah, a decent tune for me. Um, Trumble Wumba, Amnesia, mm. brilliant what tune, um, yeah, one of my favourites. Kamizwa, let me show you, DJ Quicksilver, Planet Love, yeah, it, quite a great dance tune, yeah, yeah, catchy bright beat. Rest Assured, Treat and Famy, which is, features a sample of music from uh, Business Week Symphony, hmm, kind of a pointless remix for me to be honest. Um, Woman G featuring Sissel, Prince Igor, mm, I'm not a fan of this one to be honest, mm, especially the opera. Um, Latricia McNeil, 8 Matt Just Away, mm, pretty decent in my opinion. Um, Prince Buster, Wine and Grind, The All Seeing Eye, Beat Goes On, Goldie Believe, mm, I found it boring to be honest. Um, Backstreet Boys, All I Have to Give. And vanilla, no way, no way. Yeah, yeah. I have mixed feelings about it. I quite like it overall. And yeah, but while we're going talking, the third verse is not doing really my thing. But I quite like it overall. So, this disc mainly focuses on like pop, a little dance, um, 
bit of rap and uh, yeah, a bit of variety really. So let's look at the booklet. Songs, artists, information and years. This one and this two. Yeah, very interesting album. Yeah, yeah, it's a pretty good one. So that's my review on now thirty nine. Hope you enjoy. What's your favourite of this album? Comment down below. And I shall see you next video.